square pi. And A, copacetic. You did better than me? Yeah, I took this test last year. The answer key never changes. B C B C A A B B C C D false false true William Jennings Bryan. That's cheating. Fart cheated. Young lady, in the third grade, we don't care for tattletales. Aww. And we don't care for moaners either. <laughs> Sobbing only pushes Bart's grade higher. <laughs> Bukers in back. Kids, look what I got you for your third grade field trip. Matching fanny packs. Now your fannies match. Oh. Hey, get away get from away. me. Get Ow. 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 Quit it. Ow. 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 Stop. You'll crush your juice boxes. Oh. <laughs> All right. Everybody choose a buddy for the field trip. I'll take Kyle. I'll take Ashley. Saying your buddy's name out loud is a security risk. I'll just put you two together. Oh. Swing in town, I know call Capital City. Punch Buggy Red. <coughs> Ow, you are such an immature. Punch Buggy White. Ugh. Ow! Stop fighting. He started it. He did Punch Buggy first. What's Punch Buggy? When you see a Volkswagen bug, you punch somebody and yell the color. <gasps> punch buggy blue! Ow. Punch buggy green! Oh. Punch buggy oh. Oh. <laughs> Two for flinching. Now as we cross the street, I want you to hold hands with your buddy. Hey, dude, who's your girlfriend? <laughs> you see his face? What happened, dude? Did your girlfriend dump you? <laughs> now, children, if you look up at the Capitol Dome, you'll see a mural of our state bird, the pot belly sparrow, eating our state pasta, bow tie. Wow. Order, order, order. The chair recognizes the esteemed representative from Capital City. The Capital City goofball? That's right. To win, he spent 80 million from his own pocket. Mr. Speaker, the time has come to redesign our state flag. This Confederate symbol is an embarrassment, particularly as we are a northern state. This lively debate has given me an idea. Tonight, each buddy team is going to design a new state flag. Homework on a field trip? What have you been huffing? Well, Bart's being his usual jerky self. But, Ma, I'm really excited about this new flag design. Oh, and the hotel gives you a free USA Today outside your room. No, I'm sure it's free. Okay, I won't touch it. Well, make sure you don't. And try not to let your brother get under your skin, honey. Believe me, he doesn't. His act is getting old fast. He thinks he's really cool. One last sunbeam, and we're done. To fraternal love. When I get through with that flag, it's gonna be a Bart Mangled Banner. So, I understand you children have some state flags for me. Who would like to go first? We would, Governor Bailey. Team Simpson. I spearheaded this one. I'll just unfurl this. That was my worst unfurling ever! Lisa, how could you? The governor is crying. <laughs> you weren't on this field trip. How did you get here? Biked. Bart, I am so mad at you. <laughs> you should have seen the look on your face. It was something like this. <laughs> The bus! Okay, children, before we leave, 
Is anyone missing their buddy? No. no. Ah, the buddy system. Foolproof. Floor it, Otto. without you. They left without you too, you idiot. If I'm such an idiot, how come I'm the smartest kid in the third grade? Because you've already done it once. You've lost me. Oh, forget it. Hey, how do we get back? No problem. We'll just circle around like those kids in the Blair Witch Project. I must be getting close. I recognize that girl. I think we're lost. I used to be lost until a friend turned me on to a book. A book that changed my life. It's called Lisa is Stupid. You die now! Whoa! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> They're gone. I don't know what happened. If the buddy system can fail, I don't know what to believe in. There, there, Audrey. It's happened to all of us. Willie? We have two more names for the wall. Ugh, why is it always the kids with the long names? Hello, Principal Skinner. A parent who waves a right to sue says what? What? Got it. Hey, you can't fool us. We're from the Learn to Fart State. Bird and Lisa are lost in Capital City and presumed crying. Oh, <gasps> my poor babies! I'm so sorry. Lisa's a very special little girl, and we'll spare no expense in finding her. But what about Bart? We're looking, but in the meantime, the class clown pro tem will take his place. Kawabunga! <laughs> you cold? What do you care? Here. Thanks. Where'd you get... Oh. Bart, you're my big brother. You should act like it more often. You know, protect me from the bad things in the world. Well, as far as nerdy little sisters go, you're the coolest. Thanks, Bart. And I'm sorry I sabotaged your flag. I'm sorry I got us lost out here. Oh, and I'm sorry I sawed the heads off your Malibu Spacey dolls. Okay, you go. I don't think I've done anything else. Okay, I'll go again. Remember when your bike was mangled by gypsies? Yes. <laughs> yeah, funny story. One day I was really bored, and Dad had left a steamroller idling in the driveway. This is where the kids were last seen. Oh! <gasps> the plastic casing from the tip of Bart's shoelace! A mother knows. Well, he's not gonna get very far without that. Bart! Is that you? No. <gasps> Say your prayers. Oh, Lord, please strike these mountain folk dead. Bart! Listen, we're really sorry. We got lost on a field trip from Springfield Elementary. <laughs> lost on a field trip? Heck, why'd you say so? That's how Grandpappy wound up in these parts. They was taking us to Capital City to see the Nutcracker, and I wandered away from the group, married a bear, and I started up a family. I told you I ain't a bear. Roar, roar, roar. <laughs> no one understands you, she bear. <laughs> Thanks for driving us back to town. No problem. We were going there anyway to pick up the new spy magazine. I'm sorry. They don't publish that anymore. The world I grew up in is gone. My special little guys, you're okay, you're okay. And Maggie, you no longer have to live with the burden of replacing Bart and Lisa. Well, if this episode has taught us anything, it's that nothing works better than the status quo. Bart, you're promoted back to the fourth grade. Yay! And Lisa, you have a choice. You may continue to be challenged in third grade or return to second grade and be merely a big fish in a small pond. Big fish! Big fish! Oh, The status quo. The status quo? Hi, caramba! 